Hello and good morning everyone. I am MD Saiful Islam Shakil and I will be presenting importance of fungal secondary metabolites. Before jumping into the topic, we need to know what are secondary metabolites of fungi. Secondary metabolites of fungi can be defined as chemical compounds resulting from specific biosynthetic pathways whose production is not mandatory for the growth and development of the fungi, but they are present in nature. That means these give the fungi competitive benefits in nature. They can be divided into four categories that are polyketides, terpenoids, non-ribosomal peptides, and hybrid non-ribosomal peptides or polyketides. Here are some structures of different types of secondary metabolites. Now the importance of secondary metabolites to the fungi itself. Melanin protects against UV radiation and facilitates the survival of the fungi. Pseudophores help scavenge iron from the environment. Some secondary metabolites provide pigmentation to the fungi. Many secondary metabolites play a role in the interaction of fungi with other microorganisms. For example, some fungi produce antibiotics to limit bacterial growth in parasitized insects to reduce competition. Some secondary metabolites can act as molecular signals in case of both mutualistic and pathogenic interactions. Here is an illustrative flowchart of fungal secondary metabolites and their uses. Now the importance of secondary metabolites to us. Some, uh, some fungi provides wide, wide range of antibiotics such as antibacterial, antifungal, antiprotozoal agents. Here is a picture of penicillium which provides well-known antibiotic penicillin. Some secondary metabolites are used as immunosuppressants like cyclosporin A or cholesterol lowering agents. This is a microscopic picture of Aspergillus terra, which provides cholesterol lowering agent. Some fungi like this provides beta carotene in industrial level for the production of vitamin A. This fungi provides gibberellin, which is a plant growth hormone for agricultural purposes. Some fungi has bright colors and does they are used for their secondary metabolites to produce pigments and colors in industrial level. So that's the importance of secondary metabolites to us and the fungi. Thank you very much for joining the presentation.